Hey, what's up guys? Welcome back to the channel. Welcome back to another video. If you're stopping by the channel for the first time, please consider subscribing to my channel. And while you're at it, smash that like button for me. I really would appreciate it. Also, hit that post notification bell to notify yourself every time I upload a new video. Guys, be careful down in the comment section of the videos. A lot of spam, a lot of scammers. I will never ask you to contact me by WhatsApp or Telegram. I also do not invest money for my subscribers, so please be careful. Don't get yourself scammed. If you want to keep up with me when I'm not on YouTube, get down in the description box and click on that Richard Fane Millionaire Mentor Instagram link. Give me a follow on Instagram and then send me a DM to let me know you're rocking with me so I can say thank you. If you want up to 15 free stocks, Moomoo is going to give you up to 15 free stocks when you open a new Moomoo brokerage account. When you put $100 in that new brokerage account, they're going to give you five free stocks. If you put $1,000 initially in that new brokerage account, they're going to give you 15 free stocks. Publicly traded companies, guys. Get down in the description box. Click on that Moomoo link. Open up your new Moomoo account today. Go get that free stock. Go get that free money. Today, guys, was another amazing day in the stock market for me. My biggest individual stock holding is NVIDIA, 11,200 shares. Second day in a row, it's up. Total of, I believe, 6% in two days. Now, here's my thought process. This is just my thought process. If we can get to $130 a share, that's the resistance level we need to break through. We can break through 130 and then get ourselves to the next breakthrough resistance level, which is 140, then we're clear sailing to $165 a share by the end of this year, guys. That's right. I'm going on record and telling you my opinion is if we can get through those two resistance levels, we will get to $165 a share before the end of the year. Let's take a look at the rest of the stock market, just not NVIDIA. Let's see what else is happening. Dow falls nearly 300 points to snap four-day win streak. S&P 500 retreats from record. Now, you know, S&P, Dow, NASDAQ, they've been up and down breaking all-time highs, then fall back down, break through all-time high again, fall back down. And today was one of those slightly pullback days. The Dow and the S&P slid on Wednesday, retreating from their latest records. The S&P edged down 0.2%, while the 30 stock Dow slipped 297 points or 0.7%, dragged down by more than 5% drop in Amgen. So that drug down the Dow today, Amgen. Both the Dow and S&P 500 inked out fresh records in early trading. See what I mean? Up a little bit in the first part, intraday, and then by close, they had given it all back. The 30 stock index is now on track to snap a four-day winning streak. The NASDAQ composite traded near the flat line. Notable losers of the day include General Motors and Ford. Now, y'all know these companies have been around for 100 years, which slid 5% and 4% respectively after downgrades from Morgan Stanley. So these big Wall Street firms, guys, they carry a big stick when they're grading these companies and looks like they got a downgrade from Morgan Stanley. So the stocks of both companies sold off a little bit. Seven of the 11 sectors of the S&P 500 were in negative territory. Hmm. Led lower by energy as U.S. crude futures fell more than 2%. Chevron shares slumped 2%. Tech was a bright spot in the market. Hewlett Packard Enterprise advanced more than 4% following an upgrade from Barclays. Once again, a major Wall Street firm gives it an upgrade, stock price goes up. 
a major Wall Street firm gives you a downgrade, stocks temporarily go down. Chip Powerhouse NVIDIA added 2%. Mm, that was nice bump, right? That's where we get to the 6% in two days. We're in the $3 trillion club again, guys, and I'm so excited. And I know the rest of you guys are who are NVIDIA investors are excited as well. All three averages are on track for a positive September. We talked about that earlier in my 10.30 a.m. live stream. They're on track, guys. I'm telling you, if we can ink out a positive in September, we are looking really good for the rest of the year. That's my opinion. We will have to see. All three averages are on track for a positive September. Though fears of a slowing economy still linger after last week's rate cut from the Federal Reserve. The central bank's move on interest rates has so far helped the S&P 500 defy what is usually a weak September. This is consistent with history. Stocks have tended to perform well in periods when the Fed is easing while the U.S. economy is still growing. We got both of those things happening simultaneously. Economy is still growing. Fed reducing rates equal soft landing. That's what we got going right now, guys. And that's why you see a usually negative September for stocks starting to turn into a positive September because of those two catalysts, in my opinion. This is consistent with history. Stocks have tended to perform well in periods when the Fed is easing while the U.S. economy is still growing. UBS, Global Wealth Management Chief Investment Officer for the Americas, said on Wednesday, but the Fed's level of success is guiding the U.S. to a soft landing will be important in determining the outlook for the other asset classes. Now that the central bank has begun to lower interest rates, the economy is becoming a bigger focus for investors. That's what you're starting to see, guys. You're starting to see institutional investors starting to flow back in to paper assets. That's why we're starting to see September turning out to be a positive instead of a negative like it has been in the last four years. That's what's happening due to what? Interest rates going down. I told you guys, when interest rates go down, assets go up. Companies borrow money when it's cheap and they invest in their growth, aka growth companies do better when interest rates are lower. So keep that in mind, guys, as you're trying to figure out what your game plan is for the rest of the year. Here's what I think is going to happen. The Fed has already went on record to say they got two more cuts coming. We're going to get 100 basis points cut this year. We already got 50. And you see what that has done to the market. It's rallied the market, guys. See, a lot of people didn't believe 50 basis points was coming but they shocked the world and gave us 50 basis points. That was a catalyst. That's why you see things bouncing right now in the stock market. I think what you'll see happen is, is we'll end up September in the positive, S&P 500, Dow, and the NASDAQ. We'll be in the positive for September, which is unusual for the S&P 500. We'll go into October with FOMO, and enthusiasm about the Fed dropping rates again in November. Also, we'll have the election behind us at the beginning of November. So that'll be a positive momentum just knowing who's in the White House and that's behind us. Plus, we know the Fed will be reducing rates in November. I believe they're meeting in November. And then, of course, we'll go into the last month of the year, December, with another rate cut and where investors are still optimistic about stocks, optimistic about assets. So, man, I'm excited to see where we're going. I'm excited about NVIDIA getting ready to get to $130 a share. If they can get to that resistance level and break through it, guys, then our next resistance level is $140 a share. We get past $140 a share, guys. I don't see no reason why we are not at at least 165 by the end of the year. I could be overly optimistic, but hey, that's the type of investor I am. 
I'm not a pessimistic investor. I'm an optimistic investor. And it's just my opinion, but get in where you fit in. Get yourself down to that description box and click on that Moomoo Moo link and open up that new Moomoo Moo account today. Put your $100 in there, you're going to get five free stocks. Put you $1,000 in there, you're going to get 15 free stocks. Now you're in place to be able to take advantage of these next three months. And I think they're going to be monster months. Uh, my opinion could be all wrong, but that's my opinion. But get yourself in place. Get down to that description box. Click on that Moomoo Moo link. Open up that new Moomoo Moo account today. Go get that free stock. Go get that free money. Guys, get over to my website, www.richardfain.net. Second link down in the description box. Click on that website link. Go check out the website. Go check out the digital products that I put together for you guys to help you collapse time frames and get to your pot of gold at the end of the rainbow. And then consider joining the Wealth Builders. See the t-shirt? The Wealth Builders, guys. We're the fastest growing financial community on Patreon. Guys, click on that membership button or that join button in the website and come be a part of a thousand plus people in the Wealth Builders. We're waiting on you. What are you waiting on? Click on the link, click on the membership button and come join us. I appreciate y'all stopping by the channel. And if you're stopping by for the first time, please consider subscribing. Please share the video and smash that like button for me. Thoughts become things. If you can see it in your mind, you can hold it in your hands. You guys keep chasing your greatness. Never stop believing in yourself. Stay healthy, get wealthy, and I'll catch you on the next video. Peace.